All right, give me the rules in the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. On a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, back your corners, come out fighting. Well, hopefully you can table the Louisiana bias here tonight as Dustin Poirier takes on Conor McGregor. You know Poirier's been chomping at the bit to get this rematch. Ask and you shall receive. He's finally gotten it, and he had to really claw and scratch to get back to his position. Conor disposed of him very quickly in the first fight. Dustin feels as though he's done everything necessary to change the outcome in the second attempt. Oh, huge hook. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Oh, big knee to the body. How'd he get that one home? Oh! Ooh wee! Ooh wee! What a right hand by this young man. Back to the left hand now. Unable to connect. There on that high kick. Takedown defense holds up. Nice punch land over the top. Nice job by Dustin Poirier there. Sticks the target and then moves his head off the center line to avoid the, the comeback shot. Head off the center line and watch the counter with that beautiful straight left that he throws over and over. Looking to land the right just out of range. How good is that right hand? Good left there. Oh, there. He landed it perfectly. Perfect placement. Perfect position. What a huge blow in a big moment in this fight. Under two minutes to go in our first round. Oh, wicked nice leg kick there, DC. Can't take too many of those. So just over 20 total strikes. Have found the mark for Conor McGregor. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Hook to the head lands flush there by Dustin Poirier. Oh, beautiful straight left hand. Superman punch now. Oh, nice. That Ooh, knee. Big that knee. knee hurt him. Outstanding output on both sides. Oh, perfect head kick there. Get right here. So under 30 seconds to go in what has been a pretty entertaining and active first round. Out of range with that one. That's a nice straight punch there. Good punch, got to the target. All right, so there's the end of the round. He stayed committed to doing damage upstairs and landed a seminal blow in that round. It was accumulation of those strikes. He kept hitting him over and over to the head. Eventually, he found the, the one that really did damage his opponent.
watching this guy move on the ground. Another nice transition there. Such a high-level grappler. You don't see that very often. Gets up again here, but hurting. 50 total strikes have landed for Conor McGregor. And the accuracy rate about 42% now against Dustin Poirier. Well, he's really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more of this. with his onslaught. He wanted to make sure he kept the judges out of the equation. Mission accomplished on that front as he gets the TKO victory here tonight. Well, he's going to enjoy watching this one back. Let's take a look at the replay of the knockout just a moment ago. It was right hand after right hand after right hand. Finally, he found the one that hit the exact sweet spot that ended his opponent's night. Inside the octagon, Bruce Buffer has your official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Bergliato has called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 36 seconds at round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout, the notorious Conor McGregor! Oh, well, there he is after a huge knockout win tonight. You going to the after party or what? I mean, I'm heading over there right now, John. <laughs> I'm asking the producers, how soon can I get up? This is going to be a party over there. Not only because of the knockout, but that extra bonus check is going to be carried to the club tonight.